Hey everybody, Jay here. Welcome back to the channel. And yes, today we are going to calculate and see how much shiplap board footage we got from the sawmill. So stick around, should be a fun video. everybody if you like that intro i invite you to subscribe to the channel we do a ton of stuff here on the homestead anyways here we go here's what we got here we have four individual trees we cut into shiplap so we are going to calculate how much board footage we actually came up with and then we're going to start unloading this stuff um we had two logs here we still have three logs at kevin's house that we didn't mill i wanted to start with this i only had the two hour run if you watched last video and i'll put a link to that here uh we took care those are some stickers my dad and i made yesterday um and we stacked the hardwood slabs in the hut but the ship is going to go right up in our saw shed so let's calculate and see how much board footage we got uh from four trees all right so this should be pretty straightforward i'm not going to actually calculate right now i am going to uh i'll I'll calculate in the video. So this this first section we got nine inches. So nine by nine by hundred and seven. So nine by hundred and seven by five and a half. So nine hundred and seven five and a half. I will overlay how much we got from there. Yes, nine one oh seven five and a half. Just make sure. Bing, bada boom. Okay, yeah, about five and a half. All right, so that's our first log that we milled. How about this second one here? This is ten inch pieces by the stack is six inches, so ten by six. Ten by six by nine. Ten by six by nine. Nine feet. All right, now our next row here. These are some. Uh, these are some big ones. So this next log here, we got nine and a half inch sheets. Nine and a half inch sheets by six. So nine and a half by six. Nine and a half by six by 127. That was a big one. All right now. All right, now let's calculate our last tree here. These are seven by six seven by six seven by six by a hundred and twenty four seven by six by a hundred and twenty four all right folks so we did the math here um we got nine by six by 107 divided by 144 equals 40 board uh 40 board feet for the first um stack 10 by 6 by 108 divided by 144 equals 45. 127, I mean uh, 6 times 9.5 times 127 divided by 144 equals 50. Um, 6 by 7 by 124 divided by 144 equals 36. So 40, 45, 50, 36 equals 171 board feet of shiplap. That's what we milled. We have 171 board feet of shiplap between one, two, three, four, four sections. So let's peel a few off and show you what it looks like. It looks really nice. All right, so here we go. These are just, uh, I need to, I'm gonna move these in a second, but I just kind of wanted to show you. These are all 916 thick pieces. Um, let's get a nice one here, put it on the saw horses here so you can see. All right, so here is one piece of pine, 916 or no, excuse me, 7 sixteenths we milled them at. You can see a couple entry wounds there from bugs. 
some really nice grain. This is going to make some really great shiplap. All right, folks, so let's give you a, a shot of what it looks like before. It's rough cuts on, rough sawn, whatever the term is. So let's hit it with some 80 grit real quick with the uh, real quick with the orbital and see how it uh, comes out just to kind of get these uh, saw marks. So let's go ahead and do it. Ah, check that out. That's just 80 grit. You can still see some rough sawn marks, but look at the difference between the rough cut and literally 30 seconds of sanding. Man, I like that. I like that a lot. That looks awesome. All right, so now just for kicks, we're gonna hit it with some uh, some 180 grit with the Makita here. This thing makes quick work. then so that's a few seconds with the 180 grit obviously here's our rough sawn wow what a difference I tell you I love pine it sands smooth it sands quick so I think that's probably enough for each sheet we don't have to go crazy I think 180 grit is uh, would be perfect for our ship lap I don't know let me know what you guys think all right, folks, well, here we go. That's the end. That's We're pretty much going to wrap it up there. Um, let's do some calculations, though. If I look at Home Depot, a 1-inch by 6-inch by 8-foot um, pine shiplap board. Now, keep in mind, ours are 7 16 so um, it's half that thickness. Uh, some of them are 6 inches wide, some of them are 10 inches wide, whatever. It doesn't matter. Um, let's calculate the board footage on that. So... Uh, to calculate board footage, it's length, width, height, all in inches divided by 144. So if I do the math here, 1 by 6 by 8 foot, so 8 times 12 is uh, 80, 96, 96 times 6 here. So 96 times 6, 576 divided by 144 equals 4 board foot. So for that piece of wood, that is 4 board foot, they're charging $15. So if I do $15 divided by four board foot, that's $375 a board foot. So what did I say earlier? Um, I wrote it down here. We have 171 board footage of pine here. So $3.75 times 170. Wow. <laughs> if we were to buy what we just milled here, it would cost us six hundred and thirty seven dollars for this going by the three dollars and seventy five foot for uh ship lap per board foot. That's what we calculated. So for a hundred dollars at Kevin's house, we got a hundred and seventy board footage of ship lap, all you know, six inch, nine, ten inch, whatever the diameters were, I don't really remember. And three live edge slabs like you saw in the last video and then four additional live edge slabs all of which are drying in the other video so i saved 537 dollars by milling my own lumber wow <laughs> that is crazy lumber prices are ridiculous right now so I just wanted to share with you that video. I'm excited. I was actually curious to calculate the uh, board footage there and cost. So if we were to buy this outright at Home Devo at that price, uh, yes, it would be six hundred and thirty-seven dollars and fifty cents for a hundred and seventy board feet. Um, I think I did the math right. So, anyways, yes, a hundred dollars was money well spent. So, anyways, we're gonna wrap it up here. 
Uh, on the next video, we're going to uh, take a break from the wood. We're going to clean out the uh, outdoor boiler. Uh, so stick around. That should be fun. We're going to get dirty. We got a Tyvek suit, respirator. It's getting warm out, so I, <laughs> I need to take care of it before it gets 100 degrees. Out. So anyways, like I always say, I'm a very rich man. Uh, <laughs> we have 170 good board fleet of shiplap that we're going to put in our saw shed. So that'll be coming up after next video with the outdoor boiler clean out. So yes, thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you think. If I calculated wrong, please let me know in the comments. But yeah, I think I was pretty close. So uh, anyways, appreciate you watching. Let me know what you think. And like I always say, we will see you out in the woods.